Hi, I'm Angela, but most people call me Ange. I'm on the go to one of United Way of Greater Stark County's partners. These are the folks helping to build a stronger community. Let's learn more about them. Hi, Miss Betty. Hello there, Ange. How are you? I'm blessed by the best. Well, <laughs> I am so happy to be here. That's Thank you for taking the time to mm -hmm. chat with me today. Yeah. Can you tell me a little bit about why and how Enrichment got started? I had originally had an um, organization called Multi-Development Services Stark County. Did it for about 10 years. Worked too hard. I took a break because my health wasn't what it needed to be, and it was like three years later. God upstairs is like, you can't retire, and this is like the second retirement, right? And then it was music was put in my spirit, music for young people, and there was a thing like no cost, had to be free. So I called three of my friends together, uh, Samson Toe, Beverly Bevington, some people might know her, and then her daughter, Raylena. I got them together and said, we need to do fine arts, performing arts, anything in the arts for, the, for young people. And I said, I'm gonna teach you all how to do this, and then you young people can run it, right? After one year, Raylena comes and says, Miss Betty, I need to go back to school. Samson says, I have a job in Memphis. And Bev says, Miss Betty, I'm joining a band. So that left me. And so it was like God was saying, I gave you the vision. And so the, here I said, well, I'm 72. I guess I'm gonna be around a while, Lord, is that right? And then along comes a drum line. <laughs> That so, little thing we know then, is the drum There you line. go. When I think of enrichment, obviously, I know it's art-based. But when I think about it, I think of so much more mm -hmm. than that. You're giving these kids mm -hmm. a place to feel loved, valued, teaching Safe. them skills that help them, which gives them confidence. Yes. I've seen the drum line perform right. this fall. I think you had told me that the youngest student out there was eight years old. That's right. I was amazed. And you know, Antoine, when we first started, Silas Morgan was three. His mom found him a little small toy drum and they strapped it on him. At age four, he marched in the Grand Parade with us. He is now 11 and he's still with us. So if they have a gift, we have a junior varsity that Aurora teaches. I think she's going to teach you a little something later maybe about I'm Drella. Excited yeah, about we're going to bring that. Aurora in. It's been 12 years. 12 years. 12 years. We're in our 12th year. So you have these students that have gone through and then they come back and they're then teaching and, and you know, volunteering. That's, and that's the beauty of it. Last summer, half of our staff were students that grew up in this program. We have so many success stories. Uh, one is his name is Savon Butler. And he came here from, I believe it was at McKinley, and I saw him playing with, the, with their band and he was playing the bells. And I said, I've got to get this young man. He's now a junior in college. And he says, Miss Betty, I never would have moved on if I hadn't been here in Richmond. I was at a time in life where I really needed something. I needed sustainability, I needed love, and you know, all the things that we had here. And he said, I thank you for that. And we get, we get that all the time. Yeah. This program changes lives. Now, and I uh, want to see what we can do for you here, uh, you know, coming in as a new student and see what kind of talent you have. So Aurora will assess you. Yeah. Hi, Aurora. Aurora is our program director. You don't have much to work with here, I can tell you that. This is, this is a pretty big, big drum. Yeah. And it has a lot of tension on it, so when we play it, oh, okay. a little, little, little strike goes a very long yep. way. So if we start on the pad, we'll see it says right, left, right, left. And that just tells us we're playing right, left, right, left. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So if we look at the second one, it goes backwards now. So right, left, right, right, left, right, left, left. And that's what we call a paradiddle. Right, left, left, right, left, right, right. Yep, so those are paradiddles. Okay. They're used pretty That's awesome. Now this looks scary. <laughs> it's not scary. It's a piano. That's scary. These are the white keys. These are our black keys. So let's start with a basic C scale. We go from C all the way to C. And these okay. are all natural keys, so we stay on the bottom. Look how fast you played that. Easy, and you alternated. Alternating is what makes a bell player fast. 
Look at that. Yeah, I've got a little swing to it now. Yeah. It's the advanced stuff. Thank you, Aurora. Yeah, this no problem. This was so much fun. Uh huh. I absolutely love doing this, so it's fun to share. Mm. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you so much for coming to Richard. Yes. I appreciate it. Appreciate it very much. And all the great work you're doing at United Web. We appreciate you and thank you oh, for your dedication pleasure. to the community. Seriously. Thanks for visiting another community partner with us. Join us next time to see who else is making a positive difference in Greater Stark County.